Okay, boys and girls, it is time to take a deep breath in and out as we prepare to be transported to the peace and tranquility of a Van Gogh painting. But we're not going to a museum. Oh, no, we are going to a yoga class. Did you know you can strike a warrior's pose or downward dog while immersed in a swirly spectacle of Starry Night? We sent our Terry Holloman to the Van Gogh exhibit Seattle. Check it out. Wow, Mary. This place is incredible. Can you tell us exactly where we're at? We are at the Van Gogh Immersive Experience in Soto. This is a exhibit designed to help you in fully get immersed in Vincent Van Gogh's artwork and yeah. life. Yeah, well I can tell you already, I feel 100% more relaxed, more calm than when I first woke up this morning. Why do you think that feeling is overcoming me right now? Well, it's the way the exhibit is curated. It's designed to help bring you into another place, export you or import you, if you will, into the work, the life of Vincent van Gogh. So the music is calming and soothing. The artwork is expanded so that you can fully immerse yourself into the artwork. Yeah. So you what is it. your favorite part of this entire exhibit? Oh, my favorite part is called the bedroom, and it's part Part of a three art series that Van Gogh painted of his very own bedroom when he lived in France. And this exhibit, you can actually walk into the bedroom. Oh, wow. So they took the actual piece of art and then made it three dimensional. Oh, wow. Yes. So it's I'm completely that. immersible. You do a thing here with immersive yoga, you're a yoga instructor. How does that go together? This artwork, this incredible Van Gogh art that's going on in here and yoga. So this is where we combine art and technology and yoga. So we get the opportunity to delve deeper into the artwork of Vincent van Gogh while moving and breathing together on our yoga mats. Yeah, okay Mary, so what's first? This is your very special VIP van Gogh yoga mat. Yes, yes. Um, Let's start with a little warm up. Inhale, sweep your arms out nice and wide and reach up to the sky. Now exhale and forward fold. So lead with your heart. Bring your hands down to your legs. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, now inhale, coming back to stand. Sweep your arms nice and wide and stand up. And then exhale, hands to prayer in front of your heart. Awesome. Let's bring your hands down. Okay. Okay. So now that we're warmed up, yes. Let's move into another posture, a little bigger posture. Okay. So you're gonna put your right foot on your leg. Okay. And then hands to prayer, and then focusing on one point, maybe doorknob, <laughs> arms up. Okay. There. Here goes. Nice job. Okay, foot goes to leg, and then arms up, like a Lord, tree, tree in nature. I am a tree. Beautiful. I am the tree. Van Gogh painted a lot of nature. Yes, he yes. did. Yes. But I'm the tree. And now you're a tree. In the breeze, you though. You are a breeze, breezy tree. Awesome. Okay, you can come out. That's so good. Apparently the crow pose is pretty challenging. Crow pose can be very challenging. Okay. Well, the first thing I'm going to have you do is bring your hands behind you and your feet to the mat. And this is for your hips because we're going to lift your hips. Okay. Let's bring your knees side to side. So I'm going to have you bring knees side to side. There you go. Side to side. And let's go to tabletop. Okay. So let's come to hands and knees, tabletop. Good. Now we're gonna take a cat and cow. So I'm gonna have you a arch. Cat and cow? Oh, cat and cow, yes. Yeah. So that's a like a cat and a cow? <laughs> that's the name of this thing? <laughs> that's right. It's okay. it's two two animals, two postures. Okay. But one. Let's, let's hit it. <laughs> yes. So we're gonna lift your chest and then exhale round your back. Good. Inhale, lift your chest. Okay, all right, so now our next pose is down dog. So you're gonna tuck your toes and lift your knees back for down dog. That's it, good. And pushing the floor away. 
This looks great. Okay, now this is where we start to move into our crow. Okay. So I'm gonna have you walk your feet to your hands. Let's go forward, and your hands can lift off the floor. Good, okay. okay. So now, you're gonna bring your heels in and your toes out. Okay. And then you're gonna squat down. So you're gonna bring your hands to the floor, lift your knees, and bring your knees to your triceps. Then you're going to look forward, bring one foot, maybe you lift the other foot. Oh, come on, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm not doing that today, so. Uh, okay. What do you think? So, what? We go, what is yeah. it? Walk your hands forward. So, you walk your hands forward, okay. and you push down, push okay. down really hard. Okay. Bring your knees to your triceps. Oh, lordy. Oh, lordy. <laughs> Okay. No, this is great. You look fantastic already. Oh, thank you. Okay. So use your core, core. knees to your triceps, lean forward. It's hurt my hips a little bit too, but. It's a big, it's a big one. It's a big hip opener. There you go. Yay. And then we come down. Yeah. Caca. Yay. Caca. <laughs> That's the crow. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. All right. <laughs> Can't, I need a minute. You see the crow? Wait, were you playing? Had you ever done yoga before? Never in my life. Oh. Never. I tried hot yoga once before, but oh, it's not yeah, the no, same. Not. Yeah, this was You didn't do the crow. I mean, I was really impressed. Thank you. I know. It were you relaxed or did you get like a good workout? It was a little bit of both. Oh, okay. I mean, the whole right. experience was kind of zen, kind of peaceful, but then I started doing those poses and I kind of broke into a sweat. <laughs> but cool, the scenery was cool. It was, it was incredible. You yeah. can't beat that experience. That's yeah. amazing. Well, the next immersive yoga class is this Saturday, July 8th. Terry may be there, you don't know. Um, <laughs> you do need to bring your own yoga mat unless you want to splurge on the VIP treatment, which includes a Van Gogh yoga mat. Um, and some other merch like you saw Terry mm -hmm. using with his dogs on that merch there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs>